What if I told you that you might never have to go to the dog groomer again? What if I told you you might never have to go to the dog groomer again? Well, she doesn't really care because she doesn't really go to the dog groomer, but this guy does. I'm Phaedra from All Things Phaedra. This is Roscoe, purveyor of All Things Roscoe. And we're here to talk to you today about some really cool stuff. And this cool stuff is geared towards your pet. Now, you may remember that I talked to you about this handy little gadget called the Uproot Clean. It's a simple little design that easily gets pet hair off of your couch, out of your carpets in the car, off of your rugs, and so on. Well, this company has a new device that might just solve all of your grooming needs. We are a household of three dogs, a cat and a bird. And this Uproot Clean pet grooming kit is actually going to help with every single one of them. This is what I'm talking about right here, the Uproot Clean Uproot Pet Grooming Kit. It's a small device that actually comes with six accessories that allow you to do seven different things to groom all of your pets. So whether you have a long-haired dog that needs regular grooming, or whether you have a short-haired dog that doesn't regularly require visits to the dog groomer, but they still shed like crazy, or you've got a cat or you've got a bird, this device will work for you. And as one of my viewers recently told me, I talk too much. So let's get to it and let me show you what I'm talking about. This is the power portion of the pet grooming kit from Uproot Clean. And it does plug in and it has a device for both blowing out air and sucking in air. And you're going to use this with a hose and with six different attachments that can work in seven different ways. We have the Uproot Cleaner, which should look very familiar to you. The difference is that while you are getting the hair off of your surfaces, you've got a vacuum that's going to suck that in. We have an Uproot Dryer Blower attachment, an Uproot Grooming Brush, an Uproot Deshedder, an uproot detangler and dematter, an uproot trimmer with different trimming guards. And then, as I mentioned, this device, which has controls for both suction and for blowing and for various speeds. So showing all this to you is nice, but it's time we put it to the test. Now, what makes this different than other devices is it's supposed to be extremely quiet. So we're gonna see how my skittish dog does. First thing I'm gonna do is hook up the hose to the suction end of the vacuum, give it a twist, and now I'm ready to simply plug it in and make an attachment and go. Now the two tools that I'm most excited to try are the grooming brush and the de-shedder. And that is because this one right here, this is marmalade. Marmalade, you wanna come over here? Marmalade was my inheritance. This is what my mama left me. An old English bulldog that sheds wherever she goes. She just has to look at me. I'm clearly wearing the wrong color today. And she just has like a puff of hair that comes out wherever she goes. My house never had hair until I had marmalade. So we're gonna try two different um, devices. Let's try the other one, marmalade. This is the one I really wanna try, the de-shedder. Okay, come here. Come on, look at this. Let's, oh, come here, marmalade. That feels good, doesn't it? Next victim, kitty. No, we're not gonna subject kitty to any of the grooming tools because he lets me know pretty quickly what he will and will not tolerate. You like that? All right, now we're gonna turn this on. Ah! Where Kitty comes into play is the pet hair remover, this one right here, because Kitty, his name is actually Beamer, loves to lay here on my couch. And this couch has sort of like a velour feel to it that his hair loves to stick to. And so I normally will use the regular uproot clean on this, but why do it by hand when I've got a vacuum to capture it all? Now, 
Now for the next two tools, I am going to show you the detangler and dematter and the grooming tool or the trimmer. And my, my next victim for this is going to be my sweet dog, Roscoe, because he doesn't hear that well. So I know he won't really be too bothered by the vacuum. Now, if you've never groomed a dog before, like I said, I have, it's not necessarily a fun process. So if you don't want to do a full grooming, it's still great for trims in between grooming. So this is when I suggest that you actually do a little bit of detangling before you try and groom. For the trimmer, there are three different blade settings. So you can make the blade shorter, or you can make it longer depending on how close you want to get to the fur. In addition to that, you can slide a comb on. And for this, you want to make sure it's all the way on and then you're ready to go. The built-in vacuum is right below here once I hook it up to the hose. And I'm most excited about this. This is Roscoe 100% Shih Tzu, 100% love. We're gonna gently lay him down. Ah, uh, no, you're not invited. Not this time. You were on the last segment. We're gonna lay him down, and we're gonna do a little bit of grooming. Here's Roscoe with the detangler and dematter. Let's see how we do. I'm just gonna, you don't wanna tear the hair out, so you're just gonna gently work through it. He doesn't mind it at all. And he's actually putting himself in a great position for where I want to use the trimmer. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to trim some of that hair. And now for our final three accessories. I've asked Layla to participate because Layla is what I call my little lamb pie. She's a little bit of a scaredy cat. So I've just bribed her with some treats and we may or may not use the vacuum on Layla depending on how delicate she is today. So what I've got to show you with Layla today is the grooming brush. Now, Layla is part Shih Tzu, part Chow Chow, part Poodle, if you can believe that. That's what the DNA test said. And this is one where we are going to just try and gently groom her. So I'm going to extend the brush, lock it into place, and then we're just going to, without the vacuum, just to get her used to it, just to gently brush. She's a little suspicious, but we're gonna gently brush her but we're just doing a nice light brushing. And again, this is a great way to get them used to the tool before you add any sound. So I'm gonna go ahead and attach it and turn the vacuum on the lowest setting. She's a little cautious. Let's just stay right here. Look at that. Look at that. She's not crazy about the sound. There we go. Good girl. But the last one I want to show you does require the vacuum. For this one, I'm going to switch the hose from this side to this side. Okay, Layla's back. We're going to try this with a treat, and I'm going to show you how this final accessory works as a blower. So I've changed which end it's on, and this would be great after you've just given one of them a bath. Okay, I'm gonna turn this on and you're just gonna gently blow their hair, just like this. And then there's also a heat button. <laughs> She's not crazy about that. There's a heat button too, so that if you wanna dry her as well, you could do <laughs> Okay, I, I've never seen this reaction <laughs> before. And then the last accessory, just in case you didn't get everything down the vacuum hose, 
Well, we're going to simply switch this from the blowing side to the vacuum side. And we're going to use it to clean up any hair that maybe escaped. And the great news is, if you have a bird like I do, you can use it to get the feathers. There's something for everybody. Now, when you're all done, simply disconnect the hose, press the button on top, and empty your remains. Wow, that's actually a lot. Don't you guys think? So let's summarize everything you get with the Uproot Clean Pet Grooming Kit. You get the base device right here that acts as both a vacuum and a dryer. You get a hose attachment that you can use for both a vacuum and a dryer. And you get six different accessories with seven different functions. Let's see if I can get them all right. The pet hair remover, the de-shedder, the dematter and detangler, the grooming brush, the trimmer, and the vacuum slash dryer attachment. So all of that comes in one kit. And if you're looking for a deal on this, then be sure to check out the link in my description below. And may your house be cleaner than mine. I'm doing my best. If you wanna see more of my ridiculous pets, be sure to check out my Instagram account just for my pets. It's called Nally underscore zoo because my life really is a zoo. I'll see you next time, guys.